Hi, this is Laura Thompson, Nebraska Extension Educator. For today's on-farm research field day, we're going to be looking at a study that's using ag technologies to look at nitrogen management. Field, we're looking at five different end rates 90, 120, 150, 180, and 210. We have multiple replications of these five rates in the field. Each of these blocks is about 300 feet long, and in this particular field, these were applied with anhydrous ammonia. For this study, everything is done on the go. The end rate changes are executed with a prescription, and at the end of the year, we'll look at the yield data points within each of the nitrogen rates to understand nitrogen response on the field. One thing that I really like about this study setup is that you can evaluate some lower nitrogen rate blocks without impacting too many acres. So for example, in this field, you could evaluate four replications of a lower end rate and only take up about three quarters of an acre. Another nice thing about this approach is that it can be applied to odd shaped fields. So if you have fields that don't have long straight rows, you can still put in nitrogen blocks this way and do some evaluation. So besides giving you an idea of nitrogen response at the end of the growing season, having some lower nitrogen rate blocks can give you an idea of nitrogen use or loss on the field during the growing season. If you have something like aerial imagery, you can use that to look at those lower nitrogen rate blocks and have that help inform your in-season nitrogen management decisions. So in this field, we'll be looking at yield response to nitrogen, but we're also collecting a lot of other data to be able to evaluate some things like nitrogen models, like granular or adapt in, and look at some different tools like aerial imagery to use for nitrogen management. So if you're interested in looking at nitrogen management or want to evaluate some of these tools like models, sensors, or aerial imagery, we are looking for more farmers to participate in these precision nitrogen management trials. We think it'll help you get some good information for your field, allow you to try out some of these new technologies, and we'll compensate you for your involvement. So get in touch with us if that's something that you're interested in. That's all for this week. We'll be back next week to look at another Nebraska On-Farm Research Network study.